Welcome back. We are here looking at the energy market. It's going to be my daily forecast for Wednesday, November 2nd, 2022. If you'd like to support the channel, you can hit the subscribe button down here in the corner. Hit the like button above and to see our new videos. If you want to all my trades and portfolio are available in the link down below. And please do your own due diligence before investing in the market. So let's look at the WTI oil. And as you can see, it has been had a really bullish day today. We're up roughly 2.2%. And the main reason for this is that uh, COVID uh, restrictions are basically getting relaxed in China. And that kind of means that Chinese uh, society is going back to normal and also economy. And therefore, um, demand should be increasing or expectations for demand should be increasing. And there, therefore, we have roughly 2.2% to the upside. In general, the yeah, world economy is not doing very well. We also have a crossing here, nearly crossing of the 15 to 200 moving average. It's basically a death cross, and that usually is a negative sign. So I wouldn't be surprised that in the next few days, we see this market dropping back towards the lows here of roughly 70, um, $76 a barrel. If you manage to take out this kind of stick here, which is roughly uh, 92, then we may go towards 95 and after that to 100 and then beyond that. But that is a tall ask at this current stage. MACD is uh, bullish, stochastic is also bullish, and RSI is bullish as well. So let's look at the uh, natural gas. Natural gas has been basically all over the place um, recently we have dropped quite significantly below the 200 moving average 50 moving average is moving very fast in that direction and this kind of means that we'll have a death cross within uh, the next few trading days if this basically continues we did see a massive rally here the last few trading days and today it kind of fell off a cliff minus eight percent and that could mean that we'll drop back towards a 4.7 dropping below that uh, that basically we have to look all the way down here could drop to four and then all the way down to 3.6 if that is that is going to be the case but the crossing of this uh, of the 250 that is quite significant if you look at the macd is still bullish stochastic has become bearish and the rsi is bearish as well so Hope you find this helpful. You want to support the channel by subscribing, hit the like button above and see our new videos. And good luck and thank you very much.